Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Mad TV. Today, we would like to share the Maryland series of Loan OnePlus Exponent X. As usual, we let fx be equal to the function which is Loan OnePlus Exponent X. If point x is equal to 0, we have exponent 0 equal to 1, which means that we have Loan 1 plus 1 which is equal to ln 2. Let's differentiate the function with respect to x. When we differentiate ln function, we can first take the reciprocal of the inner function which is 1 plus exponent x. Then differentiate the denominator and multiply to this function and we have exponent x here. And this could also be written as exponent x times 1 divided by exponent x times 1 over exponent x x plus 1 which is equal to 1 over e to the power negative x plus 1 when we simplify. Next, I'm going to let gx be equal to exponent x. At point x is equal to 0, we have 1. And we know that for any derivative of exponent function is always equal to itself. And at point x is equal to 0, the given derivatives is always equal to 1. Therefore, we can conclude that exponent x is equal to the value 1 divided by when n is equal to 0 we have 0 factorial x to power 0 plus the value 1 divided by when n is equal to 1 so we have 1 factorial x to power 1 plus the value 1 divided by when n is equal to 2 we have 2 factorial x to power 2 and so on so which means that we should have 1 over 3 factorial x to power 3 plus 1 over 4 factorial x to power 4 plus 1 over 5 factorial x to power 5 and so on and this is equal to 1 plus x plus 1 over 2 x squared plus 1 over 6 x cubed plus 1 over 24 x to power 4 plus 1 over 120 x to power 5 and so on but what we need here is e to the power negative x so what we have to do here is replace x with negative x so we should have 1 plus negative x plus 1 over 2 negative x squared plus 1 over 6 negative x cubed plus 1 over 24 negative x to the power 4 plus 1 over 120 negative x to the power 5 and so on and this is equal to 1 minus x plus 1 over 2 x squared minus 1 over 6 x cubed plus 1 over 24 x to the power 4 minus 1 over 120 x to the power 5 and so on so which means that 1 plus e to the power negative x is equal equal to 2 minus x plus 1 over 2x squared minus 1 over 6x cubed plus 1 over 24x to the power 4 minus 1 over 120x to the power 5 and so on. Next, I'm going to apply long division to obtain the Maryland series for the first derivative. So which means that we should take 2 minus x plus 1 over 2x squared minus 1 over 6x cubed plus 1 over 24x to the power 4 minus 1 over 120x to the power 5 divides 1. Recall that the rules of thumb of applying long divisions is always reduce the first term to 0. In order to have 0, we must minus itself. So which means that the first term we should take here is 1 over 2. Since 1 over 2 times 2 is equal to 1. And when we take minus, we obtain 0. Don't forget to multiply the rest of the terms. So we should have negative 1 over 2x plus 1 over 4x squared minus 1 over 12x cubed plus 1 over 48x to the power 4 minus 1 over 240x to the power 5. Let's evaluate. Negative negative becomes positive. So we have plus 1 over 2x and the next term negative positive negative 1 over 4x squared plus 1 over 12x cubed minus 1 over 48 
x to the power 4 plus 1 over 240 x to the power 5. So the next term we should take positive 1 over 4x in order for us to reduce the first term to 0. Since 1 over 4x times 2 is equal to 1 over 2x, and when we minus, we obtain 0. Again, multiply the rest of the terms, so we have minus 1 over 4x squared plus 1 over 8x cubed minus 1 over 24x power 4 plus 1 over 96x to power 5. Simplify, we obtain negative 1 over 24x cubed plus 1 over 48x to the power 4 and minus 1 over 160x to the power 5. So the next term we should take is negative 1 over 48x to the power 3 and we should obtain negative 1 over 24x to the power 3 plus 1 over 48x to the power 4 minus 1 over 96x to the power 5. Simplify again and we obtain 1 over 240x to the power 5. Therefore, the next term we should have 1 over 480 x to the power 5. Since when we take 1 over 480 times 2, we obtain 1 over 240. And this is the Maryland series of the first derivative, which is 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 x minus 1 over 48 x to the power 3 plus 1 over 480 x to the power 5 and so on. Recall that when we differentiate the function with respect to x, we should obtain the first derivative. In our difference, if we integrate both sides with respect to x, we should obtain the function itself, which is ln 1 plus exponent x. Therefore, what we have to do here is to integrate the Maclaurin series of the first derivative, which is 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 x minus 1 over 48 x to the power 3 plus 1 over 480 x to the power 5 and so on. And this is equal to 1 over 2 x plus 1 over 4. When we integrate, remember always power plus 1 over power plus 1. And so for the rest of the terms. But don't forget to add the constant c since this is integration. But what is the constant c? Don't worry, let's check the value of the function at point x is equal to 0, which is ln 2. Therefore, we can write it here, ln 2. Evaluate, we should have ln 2 plus 1 over 2x plus 1 over 8x squared minus 1 over 192x to the power 4 plus 1 over 2880x to the power 6 and so on is the Maclaurin series of the function ln 1 plus exponent x and hence we done. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.